Welcome back to another web weather update. I'm meteorologist Chris. We're getting a look at our afternoon highs for today, this Tuesday. Well, we can see that today will be a little bit cooler than yesterday in some locations. Grand Junction expecting to drop down to those upper 30s. You were in those lower 40s yesterday. Montrose, you'll be around the same temperature. And Glenwood Springs, you'll actually be a little bit warmer, climbing up to 35 degrees. We will, well, we did see some scattered snow showers drift in from the south during the early morning hours, and we will continue to see a few of those scattered snow showers linger on about during the earlier afternoon hours, especially down further south, closer towards Nucla, Montrose, as well as Gunnison. But for most of the western slope, these snow showers will clear up by noon, and for the rest of the western slope, they will completely clear up by the evening hours. Coldest spot on the map will be Gunnison in the afternoon hours with a high of 30, uh, 26 degrees. We will see cloud cover start to diminish once we get into the evening hours, cut down to mostly clear skies during the overnight hours, causing more lows to cool down for tomorrow. But highs will be remaining warm, and in fact, they are going to be warming up as we move forward. High pressure will start to settle in over the western slope, but if we look elsewhere in the nation, we will see a cutoff low that's off the coast of the Baja Peninsula. I'll start to push in a lot more moisture into the western slope, coupled with an upper-level trough that will start to push in at the end of the week. That will fuel some fairly significant snow and rain chances across the western slope, and they're not just going to be hitting us on Friday. They'll be lasting throughout Saturday and even into Sunday in some locations on the western slope.